Hello, uh, Vince and Jason. This is Brandon. Uh, talk to Allie. She said you guys would probably be the ones checking this video out. Um, sending this over, it's going to be three things you guys are going to be able to use to uh, bring in more business for your company. Um, I go over these three things because they're easy enough for people to do right at the office or the comfort of their own home or kitchen table. And they're also three pretty big things that Google looks at as far as how they rank people in these searches. So uh, the first thing we're going to go over is website content and keywords. Second thing is going to be citations. And the last thing is going to be uh, backlinks and referring domains. So uh, first thing we'll talk about is website content and keywords. We want to make sure we have at least 1,500 words of content on our homepage. This is something Google really looks at. Um, so when I scroll down here, uh, you got a little bit of content. And for whatever reason, it really goes a long ways uh, down here before anything else gets picked up. Uh, but you got some stuff down here at the very bottom, the service areas and things like that. So just add more content in here. By adding more content, you're going to be able to capture the keywords uh, that you're going to want to be found for. And what I mean by keywords is this. Picture yourself as your, as your clients. What are they typing into that Google search bar that's ultimately going to get Google to point that search to your website? You know, is that going to be residential roofing? Uh, is that going to be flat roofing? Is it going to be shingle roofing, roof repair, roof replacement? Those kind of keywords and then combine those keywords with a service area you're looking to do business in. I know you got a bunch listed on the bottom. Um, so roof replacement, Albuquerque, uh, roofing contractor, Albuquerque, residential roofing, you know, Albuquerque, and then do that with all the services you want to you know, do business in. So more content, more keywords is going to do you a lot of favors. Also, I went on the about us page and you got some pictures here. If I go to save these pictures, see how you got it saved as crew. Every one of these pictures is an opportunity to be saved as a keyword phrase. So once again, residential roofers, you know, Albuquerque, whatever you want to do for a keyword phrase, uh, save every one of your pictures as that. And it's going to do you a lot of favors. Uh, I then did a search of Ripper, Roofers Albuquerque, and you'll see the first thing that pops up are these ads. So people know how valuable it is to be on page one of Google that they pay for it to be there. But there's a second way uh, that you can get in the first page, and that is by being on what we call the map pack. And the way you get on the map pack is to have the most citations or be in the top three companies with the most citations, and you're going to get yourself on the map pack. So what is a citation? A citation is just your business name, address, and phone number, the same way it's listed on your Google business profile in every directory out there possible. So we wanna be on the Angie's List, the Yelps, the Yellow Pages, uh, BBBs, uh, any social media profile. Just make sure that it's the same information that's on your Google business profile. If you're unsure what a Google business profile is, if I click on this business, you'll see this thing pop up. This is a Google business profile. So if you haven't filled one of those out and been verified by Google, I highly suggest doing that. Um, it is free to do so and it's going to give you some power. So once you have that all done, go out there and shout from the rooftops. Get in every directory possible out there. And it's pretty simple. Whoever has the most gets in the map, map pack. So it's a pretty easy thing for people to do. They just don't know about it. And then the third way to get on uh, and be ranked high is, you know, organically with your website. And that's going to be with, you know, content and keywords and our pictures being saved correctly and the meta tags and information. And it also comes down to, uh, backlinks and referring domains. So to look at that kind of stuff, I use a tool here called Arefs. And this tool here, there's a monthly fee to use it, uh, but anybody can use it. And it's going to break your website down, show me everything inside and out what's going on. So it's going to show me your backlink profile and what referring domains they're coming from. Um, it's going to show me how many organic keywords you are getting picked up for. And it shows me how many people visit your website monthly. Uh, so we want to make sure we got a good, healthy backlink profile coming from good, powerful referring domains. And so what the heck is a backlink, right? Uh, any place out there on the web that you have a link and if somebody clicks on it, it brings them back to your website. That is a backlink. So we want to have a bunch of those out there, but we want to have them in in good areas. And what I mean by that is it needs to be in relevant to, to your business and what you guys are trying to accomplish. It needs to be relevant to your to your potential customers and current clients. So just because you know you need a bunch of backlinks from good referring domains, don't just go leave links, you know, anywhere you can possibly leave a link because if it has nothing to do with what you guys are trying to accomplish, Google does crawl these things um, and they look at it as spammy and they actually dock you PowerPoints for it and it, it doesn't do you any favors, just wasting your time. So um, if I go back to that, uh, <coughs> excuse me, that search I did of uh, Roofers Albuquerque, you can see in the organic section here, a lot of directories. So here's all great directories to get yourself in to get those citations. But the first ranking organic business was this, uh, was this right way. So I plugged them into AREFs just so you can see what a little bit of your competition is doing, how many backlinks they have, how many referring domains, 
how many keywords they're getting picked up for, but ultimately how much traffic is going to their website monthly. So I think you would agree that if you could get those 500 people, um, you know, versus your 19, that's probably going to do you a lot of good and, and bring some extra business in. So obviously that's the whole goal here is to make a few changes, get more eyes on your on your website to bring in more business. So go out there, add more content to this thing, add good uh, buyer intent keyword phrases uh, with service areas, save those pictures with keywords, go out there and shout from the rooftops and get those citations done so you can at least get yourself on the map pack. Um, and then do some backlinking and, uh, and get that organic profile uh, built built up a little bit. All these things are going to help you out, uh, bring in more business. Um, so like I said on the phone, uh, I'm just looking for some feedback on this video. I just want to make sure I'm sending these things out and people are able to get some value out of them and I'm not wasting anybody's time. So if you could just leave me a line of feedback, let me know what you thought about it. If you were able to get something from it, I'd really appreciate it. Thank you.